Welcome back to the Generation Ministries, episode 20. Where the lava is fake. Ding, ding, ding. But the truth is real. This week, we're going to be talking about discipline. Disneyland? No, not Disneyland. Discipline with a P. <laughs> discipline is when we make our, ourselves do what is right. In the Bible, there were these two brothers, Jacob and Esau. J Esau was the oldest, and he was a hunter. So after he was out hunting, he was very hungry, and he told Jacob, give me some soup. Jacob only said, give me, I will give you soup if you give me your birthright. And what's For those birthright? of you who don't know, a birthright is like an inheritance that the oldest child has. So when the father passes away, he receives his father's blessing. Anyway. Back to the story. So when he gave him his birthright, he was not, Esau was not disciplined. So he just gave it away, not thinking what Wait, the punishment whoa, would whoa, be. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you saying to me that this 30 to 40 year old guy is giving away his eternal blessing for a bowl of soup? Yep. Unfortunately, that's how it happened. An example of discipline in my life, well, before we say that, we all need to have discipline so we don't make foolish mistakes like Esau did. So an example in my life of discipline is when I want to go play outside, but I know I should be studying for a quiz because I know that my flesh wants to play soccer, but I know in the long run that it's more important to study for a quiz. An example of my life of discipline. So I am very tactile, which is the passion to touch things. So when I'm in a store, like a store and there's carpets and blankets and I could I touch the blankets and my mom always says look with your eyes not with your hands so I have to discipline myself not to be touching everything and have self-control in what I do an example in my life is I like to play instruments like piano guitar bass and drums and I have to discipline myself to play those instruments every day so I can get good at them that's right. In fact, the memory verse for this week is from James 1.4. And it says, Let patience have its perfect work, that you may be perfect and complete, lacking nothing, including discipline. Thanks for watching the Generation Ministries episode 20. We hope to see you again soon. And wait, we're running out of things that are fake. So give us some ideas. Yes, comment below on what we should do. Bye! Fake. Bye. Bye. Music. Now can we go to Disneyland? No, we can't. Disneyland! We have to study for that quiz. We have to have discipline. You just told them about it and you're already going against your own word. Bye, everybody. See Bye. you next week. Bye. We'll go to Disneyland later.